There's a saying that our pets are part of our lives while we are all of theirs. They wait for us, show their joy, celebrate the current moment, and fully enjoy. We strive and fail to be more like them. Oh, hey, Jang, you look like you're falling in a little bit. Jenga, all right, Jang. In her youth, Jenga led dog sledding teams in multiple races, including over 100 miles, ran along while I mountain biked, and did a fair bit of camping and swimming from a canoe. She's still excited to go and will try despite her reoccurring neck pain. Got a freeloader. Finishing up with lunch. Again, it's what we aim to do to age with a sense of adventure, calm, and dignity. So instead of winter camping in a tent, we are dog sledding to a friend's off-grid island cabin. The adjustment to smaller, slower teams should allow Jenga to keep up, then ride after a couple miles. You don't need a dog team to do this. Try hooking up your pet to your waist as you ski and pull a sled. Most dogs will probably love to be along for the adventure as long as it's with their human. Here we have the sled dog, the sun dog, and the hot dog. So here's the cabin up here that we're heading to, up in the back. Home for the night. The dogs have some spots to hang out. Time to make some dinner and eat some chocolate. What's for dinner? Well, we've got a nice big pot of snow. <laughs> One of my favorite parts with sleddies and giving dinner is the frozen meat. This is beef. Well, the fire is warm, the bed is comfy, and, and we used these old kerosene lamps for light last night. It's a heck of a lot warmer today, so we're hoping that the dogs aren't breaking through as we're doing our cross country part for like half mile to get back onto the snowmobile trail. Looks like Jenga is boycotting leaving the cabin. If you like winter camping and you want to try this sort of thing, I hope this is inspiration that you don't need to go crazy with a full dog team that three or four dogs can take you the, you know, like eight miles that we just did yesterday and are working on today. So uh, yeah, you can start small or just keep it small and not make it uh, overwhelming and more in reach for you or most people to, you know, train your pet dogs or something to pull a sled and uh, just keep it lightweight, have that backpacking mentality. <laughs> Trying a new camera mount. <laughs> Now their favorite part again, Toss. the frozen fish. Secret. Okay, deal. Watch Sailing with Jenga on the left or Getting Lost on Purpose on the right.